but the color, the sparkle, this is, look at the mess, always with the mess, Trish. Hi, welcome to Fiber Love Diary. I'm Trish if we haven't met, and if we have met, welcome back. It is May 2023, and um, it's funny. John just got back from taking Dinky to, also known as Donkey, to the vet. He had some boosters for um, Lyme disease vaccine and then another one. When he was coming home, he grabbed the mail and he brought me my paradise package. So let's open it. Don't worry, when I actually get to opening it for real, of course, as always, I will point the camera down to my table. <sighs> Crazy hair. He is in the backyard building a gazebo on our deck because we have no shade back there and we often just kind of like wish we could go out and sit you know, in the daytime <laughs> without getting burnt or having to like wear so much sunscreen and everything because it is like day, all day, just sun back there. So, so now we'll be able to. I did not see a spoiler this month. Um, cute palm trees. I have no clue what's in here, but I will say this. Paradise Fibers sends me one of these to open up on my channel and share with you guys that way. And then I purchase one to give away to one of you. So I have the one from last month to give away at the end of this video and I will draw for a winner. So all you have to do to get yourself in the running to win one of these is comment on a video starting with this one and going all the way up until the next bag shows up. Any video in between this one and that one, you could win, including the lives. If you leave a comment, chat doesn't count because the comment picker can't see it. That's the only reason. Otherwise, I would totally use the chat. So this one is a really cool one. You can, I'll actually link the last months below and so you can see what's in it. Although there were like four options. So even if you see what I opened, that doesn't mean it's exactly what's in here. I did not spin it yet. I will definitely film it when I spin it. I've just been kind of busy and actually I broke the, um, some of you know, I broke the band on my Hanson. The new ones came there. It's hooked up and working fine. So I'm gonna get back on spinning now. But like, <laughs> it's not like I didn't have another wheel I could have spun it on, right? I do. I do. Let's see, is anything else going on really? Super Sock World Championship is ramping up. If it's something that you still want to do, please make sure that you get yourself on a team and get registered. And also, hey, last video, I actually filmed a segment and then accidentally cut it out. <laughs> Lisa McCaskill, our lovely Lisa, who lives in Scotland. The Hebrides are in Scotland, right? <laughs> I'm pretty sure they're in Scotland. Our beautiful, wonderful Lisa organized a gift exchange last December, and she's gonna do another midsummer one. So if you're interested in getting together with other fiber tribers and give doing an exchange, she's basically running it through our Facebook group, but I am sure that I could get an email address from her if you would like to email because maybe you don't do Facebook. We have a couple months until, you know, it's time for midsummer anyway, but just in case you're interested and you wanna start getting yourself situated to do it, just wanna let you know, there's a pin post in the Facebook group if you want to participate. Let's open one of these. I am kind of excited, especially because when I don't see a spoiler and it's like a total surprise, that's always fun. Okay, I almost forgot. So this month, something happened at Paradise and they shipped, they printed out two different shipping labels for me and somebody in their department, their, I guess shipping, I don't know exactly. Um, I don't think he told me, customer service maybe, uh, contacted me to let me know that only one of my shipping, tracking numbers was viable if I tried to track it. And I thanked him for doing that. The truth is it often comes by so fast that I don't have time to even look 
for you know where's my shipment like I do not stress about that at all I mean it would have to be a few more days before I'd even really think about it because I'm so busy and also because I'm like I know I didn't spend last month you know what I mean so when he answered me after I said thank you he said he and his wife watch together and they love the channel so hi Eric and hi Eric's wife whose name he did not give me but I'm happy to have you here I don't have tons of stuff on my table this week Let's see I'll show you but the rest of the room looks crazy, of course. But see, there really isn't a ton of stuff on my table. All right, this is the one I'm gonna open. Okay. <clears throat> oh my gosh, the scissors all of a sudden. This last month went by so fast, I feel like it can't be already time. Like, what happened? All right, let's get the cards out. Miami Nights. <laughs> oh boy. Are there gonna be flamingos in here? Please say yes. Okay. All right, in your bag, and then we will go ahead and look at the rest. I promise to show you the rest of the cards. Here's my in the bag. Okay, four ounces of Miami Nightlife and four ounces of Beach Party. I'm not sure which is which, but we're just gonna... Okay, this is Beach Party. This is the first the first one I'm gonna show you. Look at that. So this has Firestar with it. So this is really pretty, and it does look like there's more than one tone of the kind of blue. It's a slightly, well, yeah, there's multiple tones of the blue merino. And then it looks to me like it might be the Rainbow Firestar, which is one of my favorite things to have mixed in because it just gives you like all these different sparkly colors. <laughs> you guys know how much I love the sparkly stuff. Look how pretty that is. It kind of reminds me, we did get one, hang on, of this raspberry one that we got a while ago in a box. Uh, it kind of reminds me and look how good they look together. Maybe those will get used together. Love it. And of course I haven't spun that raspberry yet. Okay, so and then so this one must be the Miami Nightlife. In the of course Gold Lame bag. I have a soft spot for Gold Lame too, but I don't think that'll surprise anyone. Oh gosh, that's really pretty. It's got like hot pink. There is some um, gosh, it's hard to tell if it's gold. Probably more colors that I haven't even identified yet. That's really, really pretty. So this is, oh, it says right on here, cyan yellow and magenta blend made of 100% responsibly sourced merino. I don't know why I almost couldn't say responsibly, but look at the three of them together. Like these together could make a pretty cool shawl. So maybe, who knows? Who knows, you know me. I'll take a while to figure it out. Okay. Okay, oh cute, you guys. All my 80s babies. I'm actually a 70s baby, but I grew up in the 80s. They will know these glasses. We all wanted a pair and then we found out they were like not very, I don't know, what's the word? Not very practical. Okay, so here is my Stella B soaps. I got the key lime scent, maybe we all did, I'm not sure. That's always very Florida, key limes. 
really like this. Um, it says, the only ingredients are olive oil, coconut oil, vegetable shortening, water, lye, mica, and fragrance. So this is a very natural ingredient soap based on the ingredients list, of course. And then, let's see, palm tree stitch marker. Did I not go, did I already? Oh, I can see it, oh cute. That is so cute. Love it, really cute. Miami Nights vinyl sheep sticker, so it's a big one this time. You know, we get different sizes sometimes. Oh my God, it's 280s, <laughs> I love it. <laughs> can anyone else hear the Miami Vice theme playing in their head? Just me, okay. Assorted neon slatted shades. We got our own pair. If you always wished for a pair in the 80s, some of you are like not even gonna know what these really represent. The camera doesn't wanna focus. Fun, and then a wild raspberry hibiscus stash tea sachet. So the raspberry hibiscus is actually one of my favorites. Thank you, Paradise. I do love these. Look at those together. So pretty, let's get them in focus, want to? So pretty. I love them. I love the surprise every month. It is one of the most fun things about this box for me. I love getting to try different fibers that I might not have picked out for myself. Figuring out how to use something that you wouldn't have bought yourself and, you know, not saying this, I totally would have bought this myself, you know, this is like me all over. But when I do get things that I wouldn't have purchased myself, I always get the opportunity to think about like how can I maybe change it or how can I spin it using different techniques to make a yarn that I will love and honestly like that has been so good for my spinning journey to be able to do that with stuff that I wouldn't have purchased for myself I almost forgot something <laughs> and I forget this like every other time so it's about this side first of all how funny is <laughs> this I love it oh it's okay so they went in search of a pattern for fun and color and they picked the Viva cami pattern. So it's like one that you can, it looks like buy, I found this pattern. It says we wanna see you getting in the Miami night spirit. Simply post a photo of you spinning this month's fiber, wearing your stunner shades to Instagram and use the hashtag Paradise Fibers Club. How fun, I love it. Um, we'll pick our favorite photo on June 15th and send the winner a $25 gift card. So, hey, if you are somebody who already gets this package or somebody who gets it in in time to get it, you can join. They want some fun for the pop collars. Remember pop collars? That was middle school for me, a popped collar. And then on the other side, it just has something about knitting that cami. Is it a cami? Yep, knitting that cami. And then, um, talking about the way that it was spun for the cami, in case that's how you wanna do it. We gotta go pick a winner, let's go. There's not gonna be as many videos this month because I had a big break in there. Not a mental breakdown, well, maybe a little bit. So <laughs> literally there's one, two, let's count the wives. Three, four, there's only four this month, so your odds are good. Okay, number two. So it is the prep tools video. Let's grab a link. It's all right. Okay, I do include replies, but not myself. I don't filter duplicates. We don't get any anyway. Nope. Don't exclude anybody. Nope, nope. So we'll get comments. It says there's 96 on that one, and then we hit start. Casey Bryant, you win, congratulations. All you have to do to claim your prize is email me at fiberlovediary at gmail.com with your snail mail address, and I will get it out to you. 
I will see some of you on Sunday for a live crafting, whatever type of crafting you wanna do and hanging out together. And otherwise, I will see you next Tuesday with a video. Thanks, I love you, bye.